international experience has been a historic moment for the team, but it's also proven to be a moment of healing for Chancellor Lee and Sandra Adams. They've been on this journey together for almost 20 years, watching this team from afar, but their story has also inspired a life-changing gift from one of the Panthers' biggest fans. How do you feel about going to London? I'm happy. You happy? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Yes. The days couldn't go by soon enough. I'm marking off the days now on the calendar. An experience of a lifetime, almost 20 years into their journey. It's just what I expected. Because when I went on this journey, it was not about me nor Chancellor. It's about helping other people overcome any trauma or tragedy that they've gone through, especially the death of a loved one. The loved one for Sandra Adams is daughter Sharika. In 1999, then Panthers player Ray Carruth, Sharika's boyfriend, was convicted for orchestrating her murder. Sharika was pregnant when she died, but her son, Chancellor Lee Adams, survived. We are living testimonies that there is hope. Their testimony has reached the world and right here at home in Charlotte, where their story inspired one of the Panthers' biggest fans and fan club founder. He just wanted to do something special for us. In the spring, the Roaring Riot announced its new foundation, which couples their fundraising efforts with a chance to create a rare experience for people who may not otherwise get the chance. In their announcement, the foundation named the Adams its first recipients inviting them to London. Adding, quote, I think you'll all agree that the Carruth story is the darkest part of our team's history. Then added, it became very apparent that the best way to move on from this dark past is to embrace the light that has come from it. Oh, where are you going? London. London. So with luggage in hand and ready to roll, Sandra and grandson Chancellor Lee are off to London. The moment no more real than walking the streets in England amongst a wave of black and blue, feeling right at home. Last year, this time, we were a bit anxious about the release. Yeah. So here we are a year later, yeah. celebrating in London, you know, just yeah. enjoying all the London sights and the excitement. I can't even control the smile. No. <laughs> From ear to ear and green. Ear to ear, it is so authentic. It's just so, I'm, I'm, I'm like, it's just, it's just, I can't even describe it. It's just no words for it, how grateful I am. And we're just so grateful. We're so grateful. And next month, Chancellor will celebrate his 20th birthday, and his grandmother said this was really the best gift they could have asked for.